Despite being a keen runner for the past 20 years, Alison has never completed a full marathon before. Looking for ways to give back, her manager suggested she take on the Sierra Leone Marathon, run by charity Street Child. Just looked amazing, their values, uh, the projects they do out there, you know, and I think what appealed to me is that we go out there for five days, four days before the marathon, we go out and see the communities and meet the children, so that really appealed to me. The marathon has taken place for the past six years and follows a route that travels through tropical forests and local villages in 30 degree heat. But Alison says her motivation doesn't come from the physical challenge. I mean, in this case, it's the motivation is going out to Africa and doing it for Street Child, raising the profile of Capstone, meeting the kids out there. So, and also someone else in Capstone, coincidentally, is doing the marathon as well. So that, that's a really good motivation. I think without that, I think it would be difficult. Um, and I just, I really like the idea of going abroad to do it. Training for long distance running can include a lot of preparation, but it can also make things more difficult. And for Alison, it hasn't been plain sailing. I think with the winter we've had, it's been hard because I've been poorly and had to have a few weeks off. So I did 10 miles this morning, nearly 10 miles. So I'm kind of back on track, but I just have to pace myself. So it's, got, it's not going as well as I thought it would, but you know, no one's perfect. And I'm not going out there to get a personal best. I'm going out there to help others. So I'm happy. Everyone who is running the marathon on the 27th of May is raising money and awareness for the charity Street Child, who believe every young person should have access to an education. I mean, it's, it's a really popular charity. I can see that it has a lot of support, but the values it upholds, you know, such as empowering children, empowering communities that struggle financially, that have struggled. Sierra Leone, you know, historically has really faced difficulties. So for me, that's something that um, really resonates with me and also it kind of mirrors the values of Catstone. Alison will be making the trip to West Africa to see what can be achieved with the money she raises and to meet the children whose lives she may be affecting. She says that she is nervous but excited for the challenge ahead. Jack Deary, That's TV.